Texas is home to some of the greatest songwriters of our time. In tonight's Texas Voices, Leroy Parnell tells us how growing up in Texas shaped his music and his life. All it takes is a tender moment. Country music fans fell head over heels for Leroy Parnell as soon as his soulful country sound hit the scene. But it was a lifetime of preparation. Well, I was around music my whole life. My father and Bob Wills were friends from the time they were little boys. Just lifelong friends. I, I referred to him as Uncle Bob and Aunt Betty. I mean, that they were family to me. His parents, the picture of grit and grace. Roy Parnell toured with a teenage Bob Wills, and Annabelle Parnell had the voice of an angel. A young Leroy grew up on the ranch near Stephenville, branded by the music. Like my father once told me, he said, son, there's no need to tell anybody, uh, ask anybody if they're from Texas. I said, no. He said, no, because if they are, they'll tell you. And if they're not, there ain't no need in embarrassing them. <laughs> One night at the corner of Main and Exchange in Fort Worth, Leroy sealed the deal on his direction in life. There was only blue lights on the men on stage but they were all wearing white hats. And that was the most beautiful thing I'd ever seen in my life. Now, I knew two things. I knew ranching, which was hard work. And I saw those blue hats, you see. And I went, I know what I'm gonna do. He somehow always knew. Leroy got about the business of becoming not just a talented guitarist and vocalist, but writing the songs he sings. It's elusive. Mm -hmm. I'll tell you that. Uh, I heard Haggard say one time that he just, he said, I don't know where it comes from. I said, I don't know either, but I'm I just glad it's still coming. It's like an artesian well, don't ever stop it yeah. or it'll go away. It's almost like the idea is like lightning striking mm -hmm. and you got to grab it right then and then stash it away for later. Mm -hmm. Because I do believe that it's about 10% inspiration and about 90% perspiration. Music, he says, calms the savage soul inside of us. His love for words, shared by his love, artist Lisa Stewart. Leroy, on a daily basis, these pearls just fall from his mouth. It's just, it's just like, this is the way he talks. Yeah. And uh, I tell him he's the thinker upper and I'm the writer downer. Check out the rainbow. A rainbow would show up just now. She's not just a writer downer, she's a wonderful writer and the best female singer I've ever heard. It's once in a lifetime. And it won't come again. Now they're on the road together, writing, singing, and giving all they've got. It's a part of who he is, just like his blood is in his veins. I mean, it's like that for him. And it's like that for me. Music is just a part of, it. it's in there. Thanks to Leroy and Lisa for sitting down with us. Now catch more interviews with incredible Texas songwriters this Thursday at 6.30 when we air a Texas Voices special. It all starts with a songwriter. Texas Voices features the artists, musicians, and creatives in our great state. Well, still ahead of